Welcome to Psalm 102. I sort of love the visual uh, that I got for this one because, well, I guess I love the printable. I don't know. He always just gives such different ideas that are so interconnected. So um, Psalm 102 is called From Tears to Praise, um, a prayer for those who are overwhelmed and for all the discouraged to come to pour their hearts before the Lord. So I love, I mean, it's fall, right? And everybody's starting to get the idea about pumpkin spice into their head. I think it's already actually at Starbucks. So I, I liked the idea of that fall leaf and that um, so many times we can look at that fall leaf and we can see it as um, as death, you know, that it is we have to let go of things and we have to um, shed that skin. Uh, but I love the expression that trees just give us such a beautiful example of what it means to let go and release into tomorrow. Because if we can let go of yesterday, like, did I say that right? If we can let go of yesterday and just grow in deep and trust in tomorrow, I mean, what a beautiful place that is. What a beautiful way to do life of just letting go of the things that are just too heavy to hold on anymore. The things that, that cannot go from season to season into for us. You know, the Lord calls us from one adventure to the other, from one adventure to the other. May we never think that we've made it or we've arrived, you know? So um, that fall leaf to me represents letting go of an adventure and not wanting to live there and inhabit that adventure forever, but know that he's got something great coming right around the bend. And it might be that I need a season of prayer or dormancy or a season of not in order to bloom and create fresh fruit again. But there's also um, this idea of, there's this desperation in this Psalm this week, an absolute desperation. Lord, listen to my prayer, listen to my cry for help. You can't hide your face from me in, the, in my day of distress. Stoop down to hear my prayer and answer me quickly, Lord. Stoop down. Come closer to me, God. I, I can't even get up anymore. I can't raise my head. Would you come to me and just lend me your ear? For my days of happiness have gone up in smoke. My body is raging with fever. My heart is sick and I'm consumed by this Ill illness, withered like a dead leaf. I can't even eat. This is somebody that has given up. There is nothing left. Withered like a dead leaf, not expe expecting what tomorrow might bring, but feeling like the dead leaf that fell from the tree and is now being stepped on and rolled over and being pawed, caught up in debris and waiting to be put on fire. This, this, the person that's in this psalm feels like the cast off, the, the cast aside, the, the invisible, the distressed, the hurting the lonely, the depressed, the ill. But remember what he says, would you stoop down? Would you stoop down and hear me, my cries? My every enemy mocks and insults me incessantly. They use my name as a curse to speak over others. So like they would say, may you, if you don't, may you feel like Lisa feels one day. Like that is a curse that they're speaking over other people. Because of your great and furious, furious anger, all I do is suffer with sorrow. Um, my crying fills my cup with salty tears. Wow, my crying fills my cup with salty tears. What am I drinking? What am I living on? My salty tears. I'm living in and being sustained by my tears. So remember though, would you stoop down? Candle is the representation of those prayers being uttered, those prayers going up so that he can just stoop down closer into my circumstances. He listened to all the groaning of his people longing to be free and he set loose the sons of death to experience life. He comes to us. He comes to us. If we are a leaf that feels a cast down and overlooked, if we are just 
despondent in our despair, when we send out our prayers to him like this candle, he responds to the prayers of the brokenhearted. He loosens the sons of death to experience life. That is our God. He replaces death with life. If you feel like you are just surrounded by death, desperation, depression today, send out a prayer to the Lord because he will stoop down and he will hear you and he will respond to you. Read this psalm out to him today. Put your name in and make it a personal prayer to your God. He will listen. He will respond. So that's Psalm 102, guys. I'll see you next week on Psalm 103. Bye!